Welcome to This and That with Jenny. Welcome to This and That with Jenny. This is the second episode of This and That. I'm doing one a little earlier than I was planning on doing because some people want to see more of my material. Now I'm doing this at 2.30 a.m. before I go to bed. Probably a bad idea. About as bad as when I stuck my finger in a light socket when I was three. Actually, I didn't do that. That was my cousin. But that brings us to the topic of our episode. Our topic is electricity. My cousin probably has a fear of electricity. And the phobia name for that is electrophobia. Actually, she doesn't because she uses electricity all the time and leaves her lights on. <laughs> Wasting electricity. I'm just going to tell you a little bit of fun facts about electricity brought to you by um, ellenandrykids.com um, Let's see, a spark of static electricity can measure up to 3,000 volts. So you probably get a little shock to the heart if you actually touch someone that much electricity. Um, electricity can be made from wind, water, the sun, and even animal manure. Animal manure. So when you're walking out on your farm, and yet accidentally step in animal manure, you might just feel a little tingle. And that's not from the warmth of the manure. Alright. Thomas Edison has been coined the inventor of the light bulb, which also takes electricity, obviously. But that is not true. In 1802, Humphrey Davy had the most powerful battery in the world at that time in Great Britain. And in that year, he actually passed electricity through uh, the suit of platinum, which is metal, obviously, and he calls it a spark, which was uh, light, which is like light bulbs. But obviously, with the name of Humphrey Davy, it didn't quite catch on. And also, Thomas Edison kind of stole it and made uh, his own light bulb which lasts a few minutes, a few seconds longer than that little spark. So, obviously Thomas Edison is known for inventing the light bulb. Alright, I told you that I was going to show you some cute little pictures of pets. Well, I don't have any at the moment, but I do have some of my own pets that I can show you. Um, I'll show you that. The first one I have is Peanut. Yep, he's a little weird. He has his own characteristic. I mean, character. Um, and then I have another one. It's Rocky, which is they're the same breed, but he's a little smaller. But he overpowers the big one, surprisingly. Also, since we're talking about electricity this episode, I'm going to show you a few pictures I found on the internet of animals and their fight with electricity. And here's a cat that has a funnel on his head. He shouldn't have stuck his, thing, his paw into the light socket. It will... And here we have a cute little kitten who just passed out from all that heat from electricity. That second episode of This and That with Jenny. Hope to see you next time on This and That with Jenny.